I've been working in the industry for about 18 years. And RIT gave me a full-time uh, uh, teaching opportunity here. Mm -hmm. I decided to join in 2008. We do have uh, uh, professors ranging from nine years to some of them have uh, 20 to 30 years experience in industry. And uh, they bring their uh, industry skills and knowledge into the correct classroom. That's one of the best things about uh, coming to RIT. So the faculty here are super passionate about what they do. I really feel like it's RIT's greatest asset um, because they come from so many different walks of life and different industries within the IT industry um, that they bring so much experience into the classroom along with just having that great teaching ability where they really connect and click with students. When they have a networking degree, uh, they are able to manage and create uh, networks, uh, organization from healthcare to the computer companies and uh, technical companies. These days, a lot of organization and combine multiple organization into one. So you got to be able to know networking, be able to configure routers and switches, being able to do automations and soft define. Uh, in the classroom, we do practical exercises ranging from uh, in-class uh, problem solving, and also uh, labs such as uh, working on the uh, sensor modes and the sensor networking, and a lot of practical uh, skills so that they get to actually uh, put their hands on uh, things they learn in class. I feel that our students be able to uh, think critically, which means that when they run into a scenario or situations, problem situation, they will be able to think critically, be able to solve the quick problem quickly as possible. And they're able to do uh, uh, Python scripts, C programming, so that uh, they can expand their, their careers when they get out in the industry. There's, um, if a student is really passionate about a specific area of IT or networking, um, all they really have to do is reach out to one of their professors um, who may have an interest in that field. The most of the research projects that are being uh, done in RIT are directly inspired by the industrial projects. RIT has assigned different uh, networking labs to the students and there are many other of my friends who have been working with me on different projects like collection of BGP and OSPF performance matrices. The project that I'm working on typically deals with uh, building a completely new routing protocol. I can it's not mandatory, but they can take advantage of the COA program and the intern as well. Um, many of our students uh, were able to find a co-op position during the summer. Also, that uh, you know, when they work at co-op at many uh, industries around the country, they get to put paid uh, full time, and they can once they come back, uh, many of them go do go back to the same company, or they are able to find a better uh, position uh, at companies uh, such as Google, Microsoft, Semantics, many other companies around the country. We have a phenomenal facility, and that's the one of the separated from the other university, is that uh, we have a great labs. We do have uh, routers and switches and access points. We have what we call the cage. We have uh, sensor modes, mobile devices, and many other equipments in the cage. And the students are not limited to because lack of equipment here. We have a plenty of equipment. We have more than enough, and. Uh, they just need to bring the ideas and they can really... Uh, our department decided to offer all of our core courses online. And most of our uh, elective courses offers can offer online as well. We do have some simulator lab available and students will be able to remotely log in from anywhere in the country so they can work on your uh, virtual lab setting as well. They'll be able to uh, uh, fully uh, graduate, get their degree online. I chose networking at RIT because I believe they're leaders in the industry um, and I feel that they're um, very mature in what they do here as far as education and technology goes. Um, what I learn here is very applicable to the real world and um, what they're learning and all the cutting edge technology that's now just coming out. RIT really keeps up with their uh, curriculum and what they're teaching students.